hello everyone and yes welcome back to the channel and you guessed right we're back in the woods again and we're going for another night sleep aren't we jake yeah but this time we have got our mats because last time we forgot them oh uh, yeah we've got the roll in the last video i forgot the roll mats uh but this time i bought them so that is a winner um so as of today it is currently saturday and the time is around half past four a bit cloudy yeah. forecast is it's not gonna well it's not supposed to rain but you know british weather whatever is what it is how do you check the forecast in the uk wake up and look out the window you never believe the weather man i don't think that's how you i think you just go on the weather cast on your phone yeah but it's always wrong though mate isn't it it always says it's going to be nice or it's just it's always wrong or, or rainy they're just anyway yeah so what we're going to do is we're going to spend our second night in the woods, um, Jake's second night, mm -hmm. looking forward to the second night again in the woods? Yes. Yeah? Don't know what shelter type we're going to put up today, um, not too sure yet, might just go with the old trusty PowerPoint, uh, can't go wrong with it, I like that setup, it's just because it gives you the shelter and you get, um, it's nice and open as well, you get nice, nice views, so yeah. Dad, turn your head up, sit that up backwards, look at his tail. Guys, look, look at his tail. Look at that. I need a haircut, mate, don't I? Oh, yeah. Mental. Yeah. And the midges are out now as well. Oh, <laughs> they are irritating. Yeah. Can't wait to get a little fire going, get some smoke about, get rid of these little geezers, because they are irritating me already. Oh yeah, you know what time it is. It's bungee time, all right. Hello, there we go, and there is home for the evening. <clears throat> Not too shabby. So there's a storm on the west coast um, of England. Um, well, not England, the whole of the UK, so like, uh, but being an island white, I don't think it's supposed to venture uh, this far anyway, but you never know. Um, if it does get a bit crazy, and you know, if I do think it's becoming a bit unsafe, then we'll simply just pack up and go home, won't we, Jake? Yeah. Because we don't live too far, like literally five minutes. Yeah. We can just pack up and bug out, should we need to, but I think we should be good. We should be good. No if forecast you... warnings here. I don't know why I'm filming, I don't know why I'm talking like this and filming trees. <laughs> Ooh, there we go. But yeah, that's home set for the evening, so I just put the ground mat, well, um, Oh, what's the words? Ground sheet down. Put the mats down. Yes, got the mats today, didn't we? We didn't forget them because that was so uncomfortable the other day. And yeah, Why so what we're going to do day? is go and start gathering. the other day. Well, you know what I mean. Not the other day, but the other week. So what we're going to do is go and start gather some firewood. Firewood? Um, firewood, firewood you, yeah. yeah, we've got a little bit. We need to get more, don't we? Just yeah. in case it does start to rain, mate. We need to make sure we've got plenty of supplies. Should we use this for the big one? Uh, this for the Is that a big one, mate? Yeah. You got a big one there? Yeah. I'm just going to chuck it. Oh. Jake's brought his little notebook with him today. Yeah. And a book to read. Documenting what you've been up to, isn't it, mate? Mm -hmm. Yeah? Yeah. You're going to wait here while I go and find some logs. Yeah. All right then, mate. Okay, so what me and Jake have been doing is just getting uh, various sizes, uh, bits of wood uh, ready for our fire later. Um, obviously starting off with the kindling type wood um, to get the fire going. 
then the little twiggly bits next on top and then as we move up obviously they get thicker and thicker until the fire is established and then you can start putting the bigger bits of wood on uh, we want to get it nice and hot to cook some grub later and you'll never guess what we got again yeah we got burgers because they're easy wow uh, just one thing to know is you don't need expensive gear to do this you really don't i mean the most expensive piece of equipment that i have is the tarp i mean i think that cost me 37 quid uh from uh dd hammocks um but yeah you really do not need um expensive gear to do this um at all uh the sleeping bags i got from mountain warehouse uh they do the job because like i say we're coming out of winter now so i'm not too worried um and obviously it's way too cold to be doing it with jake in the winter anyway so you know what we've got at the minute does the job um and it's really good so but look, yeah you, you really don't need expensive stuff to come out and just enjoy the woods or being out in the wilderness um can like you need to stay saying um i watch these videos back and I'm like um 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 like a right dinny but we'll get better as we do more as we grow here he is little jake or right, geezer yeah are you getting a bit hungry mm, yeah yeah, me too. Don't know if we should start a fire yet. It's probably a little bit too early. Don't want, yeah, because it's only six o'clock, so we don't want to be um, lighting fires just yet, I don't think. Because, you know, people might be walking about still, the dogs, and they might get a bit, oh, what are you, what are you doing? Even though I know what I'm doing, they don't know that. Before they know, I could be some lunatic in the woods just making fires. But I'm not. But yeah. Those people have to be done. So here I am just minding my own business. Jake's babbling on. Turn around. <laughs> I'm getting turned to his car again. And he's only brought his pajamas with him. Yeah. Jake, you getting settled in for the night? Yeah. Yeah. Might want to keep that on, mate. Yeah, I am. I didn't even know he bought those, a little lunatic. So I'm just gonna put my pajamas on, thinking he's gonna put his onesie on. Whips out his actual pajamas. Little nutter. Oh, I've got my pyjamas. It's getting a bit breezy, mate, isn't it? I know. Dad, come here. I'm going to expose you. Why are you on the sofa? Do you think I'm on the sofa? I'll tell you what, Jake has bought a right little bag of trucks in today, so not only has he got his pyjamas in a pin, you got this little fella. Got this little fella Par Apparently he's on overwatch tonight, so he's going to be uh, keeping his eyes peeled. And he's going to be right there, oh. looking out who else, behind. Who else we got? Baby Yoda. Oh my goodness, we've got Yoda. Looking that way to look at... Some other rude boy. I'm so... Some that wind boy. is picking up though. We'll just have to play it out and see how it goes. If it gets too bad, then oh, we'll just Jesus. pack up and we'll head back home. Because I don't live too far away, so... Dad, um, those trees are smashing. Yeah, I think... Yeah, we'll just see what happens. Like I say, there's no weather warnings out for a lot of wind or anything like that, so I think we should be good. We should be good. And, worst case, look, look at this. In the distance, someone's already pre-made. Look at that shelter thing. So we can just whip under there and... Yeah, we'll chill under there if we need to. But I think we'll be good. We'll be good. Oh, baby Yoda, He's keeping kicked. guard. Keeping a lookout. Oh, he's on stag. Look at him over there. Yeah. Him. He's, he's looking on the, he's watching out that way.
So, follow me. We, we can go on there, on that field, shall we? Let's go. Let's go. Follow Let's me. Check out Jake in his onesie now. Yeah. Getting settled down for the evening, mate, yeah? Look, still got my pajamas on. Still got the pajamas on. Got my thermal. Thermals. I'm winning. Let's go on the field. Oh, Dad, this one wasn't that funny when I fell on the wood. Yeah. That was funny. Let's go on the field. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go on it. You eat your burger. Yeah. I didn't know you had your burger on your hand. Okay. My, yeah. What? Yeah. Oh, no. You can get that now. Oh. Um, I won't stand it. Hello? Hello, guys. Stop. Hello? How was your burgers, mate? Good. I haven't even had it. You still got the other one? No, I haven't even got it. Oh, it's starting to get dark. Yes, we're losing light. We're losing a bit of light with that. Yeah. That sunset is nice, isn't it? That was nice, mate, wasn't it? <laughs> yeah. I like, cool. I like that field. Nice and cool. This is nice and cool. Starting to get. We're losing a bit of light, aren't we, Dad? It is, mate. It's starting to get dark. Um, yeah. Okay, guys, just a little update for you. Uh, it's currently about half past nine. Um, me and Jake have packed up and we're heading back to the van because it's got pretty windy and Jake's getting a bit, um, yeah, he's just not really enjoying it. So, last thing I want is for him to be scared coming to do this. So, I said, mate, if you want to go home because you're not feeling comfortable, then we can go home. It's no problem. We'll pack up and go home. It's not a drama. You know, there's no point in, you know, getting yourself scared or anything like that. I, I don't know how much you can see because I've got the red light on, so you might not be able to see me at all. But anyway, we're heading back to the van and we'll catch up with you in a bit. That was pitch black. Well, that is me and Jake back at the van now. So, yeah, like I just said, I don't know how much you've seen or heard or whatever. But, yeah, it's getting, well, it's just gone half nine. It's getting pretty windy and the tree is pretty noisy in there and it, you know it's when the trees are clunking and screeching and rubbing together jake was getting a bit worried and i don't want him to be worried i want him to enjoy himself a lot when we're out doing this sort of thing so he wants to come home so we just simply packed up and we're gonna head home isn't it mate yeah yeah you want to have fun in it i don't want to be scared just in case anyone's wondering the fire was completely extinguished i had two liters of water that I didn't even make a brew out of, so the whole lot went onto the fire. Not that it was a massive fire anyway, like I said, it was only a little twiggy stove. But yeah, anyway, if you like the video, as always, like and subscribe. And we'll see you in the next one. Shoo! <laughs> Shoo!